New documents show concerns of mismanagement at a longtime Jacksonville nonprofit. Back in August, the Claire White mission drew attention when a majority of executive board members left. On your side, Satia Collins spoke with a spokesperson for the nonprofit in this exclusive interview. A document titled Board Concerns highlights 15 points of conflict from former board members with leadership at the Clara White Mission. Included in the letter are allegations of CEO Jacoby Pittman's alleged refusal to provide board members with a credit card statement and claims that Pittman instructed staff not to share information with board members. The document was attached to the resignation of former board president Michelle Paul. While Pittman declined to comment, a media consultant for Claire White Mission says until a public statement is made, the mission has no reaction. There's not anything of public record that we need to be responding to. Anything that are documents, I think you said it earlier, they were attached to a resignation letter of a board member. Our news partners at the Florida Times Union first reported the letter's existence and through their investigations found that the city's office of the inspector general has been conducting interviews with those involved. No official investigation has been announced and the office tells First Coast News it has no comment. Clara White representatives say Jacoby Pittenham is thriving in her leadership role and the mission is focused on serving. We don't have a reaction here at the Clara White Mission to any allegations. Allegations are for courtrooms and we're focusing on the legacy campaign. We're not focusing on anything else that has happened. We're accentuating the positives here at the Clara White Mission. Reporting, Atia Collins, First Coast News, on your side.